everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I am back in Altoona, Iowa. We're right outside Des Moines. It's been many years. I was first here back in 2010. I think it was my 10th win ever, but we've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. We are here. It's my first time here at Brick and Ivy Rooftop which is to the west of Adventureland. Right, yes, obviously from the name, they've got a rooftop, but the Brick and Ivy comes from the stadium in Chicago for the Chicago Cubs. But I am here, as you can see, I've got a one sitting time limit to dominate their Chicago Dog Challenge. I've got one sitting to finish all of these. There are eight super-sized Chicago dogs. They've got the buns, which are poppy seed buns, I think from Chicago, but we've also got quarter pound hot dogs, those are massive, so two pounds of meat total. And then all of the typical Chicago dog toppings, onions, tomatoes, sport peppers, relish, and mustard. And then we've also got, I'm excited, we've got fried pickle spears. So if I fail to finish in one sitting, I'm going to have to pay $30. But if I win, I'll get my entire meal for free. I will get a sweet t-shirt. They're also going to throw in a hat if I dominate the record, which is set by my friend Ethan Teske, eager Ethan Teske, which is 39 minutes, and I will have my name and photo up on the wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. All right, big thank you to Brandon, the owner here at Brick and Ivy Rooftop. They opened back in 2020, March 2020, a great time to start a restaurant. They had to start out as takeout, but once they could open in for dine-in, uh, they started this challenge. So many people have tried, only five people have actually been able to finish. The number three time is like two hours and 34 minutes. But my friend Eager Ethan Teske, he's got the record, 39 minutes. We're gonna try to smash that. This is not required, it is by fire truck. It is the tropical burn. We'll finish this along the way, but time to shut up and eat. One, two, three. Oh. Boom. All right. Ethan recommended to eat some of these fried pickle spears first. Oh yeah. I'm gonna need this spoon, and I do want to clarify, I am not a Chicago Cubs fan. I'm from St. Louis, so go Cardinals. <laughs> I just have my blue on because of the Chicago theme. All right, let's get all this down. With all these toppings, I'm glad I have my healthy vegetable shirt on. I'm pretty much gonna have like a vegetable salad at the end. These are amazing. Is it bad? It look good. I don't want to look like Beard Meets Food when he gets all that crap in his beard. Four minutes in. Ethan warned me there was gonna be a lot of toppings and he was right. There is some spice here, that's for sure. Five and a half in, halfway.
trying to be as clean as possible. I'm moving at a much quicker pace than last night, that's for sure, in uh, Sioux Falls, South Dakota. These are very good fried pickles. Eight and a half minutes in. Starting to get full. Eleven minutes in, done with number seven. I'm gonna one bite this. No, I'm just kidding. Pickle. Technically, because of what time we're here, I could sit here for like four more hours, finish this, and still get the victory. So, let's get done with this food. Cheers to a delicious challenge. But even with the extra time of filming and photos and stuff, all eight of those Chicago dogs were amazing. I got them all down with the extra beer. 14 minutes and 50 seconds. That is the new record time to beat for the Chicago Dog Challenge here at Brick and Ivy Rooftop. But that is not the time that you have to beat in order to win. It's pretty much a one sitting time limit. But they've got a wall of fame which has the top three times. So I am gonna get my name and photo up on that wall of fame, but for everybody that doesn't have a top three time, they're also going to have an honorable mention wall of fame upcoming. I am going to get not only a sweet hat, I am going to get a sweet t-shirt that they already had ready for me. We've got Brick and Ivy Rooftop, the logo on the front. And then on the back, we've got, I do actually like this because the play on words. Holy cow, I ate them all, because I had to eat the eight Chicago dogs. It was overall win number 985, so just 15 more until I get the big four digit 1,000. I'm going to be in Marshalltown, Iowa tomorrow, taking on a Monster Burger Challenge, but thank you guys for watching.